Все, кто сознательно встал на путь предательства, кто готовил вооруженный мятеж, встал на путь шантажа и террористических методов, понесут неименуемое наказание. Ответят и перед законом, и перед нашим народом. Вагнер itself um, no, is not playing the role uh, on the front lines that it, uh, that it used to. I think it would be very surprising if it would. That said, we are still seeing it um, do other things, particularly getting, you know, remaining involved in, in conflicts in, um, in sub-Saharan Africa, in the Sahel, uh, to a certain extent in, in South America. Despite uh, the spectacular demise of Prigozhin himself and the problems that Wagner got itself into as a result of that, the model Right. The idea of a private company profiting from this war right, uh, is one that is attractive to a lot of people uh, in, uh, in Russia. We have not seen kind of the, the loss of confidence in the Kremlin that we might have expected to see from among sort of the Russian elite uh, and sort of the rich and powerful uh, men mostly around, around Putin. Um, which might, in fact, signal that the Kremlin is stronger than we think, right? That it can afford uh, a certain amount of, of chaos and, and dysfunction, and, and, and yet the core holds solid.